and welcome to the tripod tutorial. As you might already know, for the creation of a full panorama, such as this one, you need to take pictures of the whole 360 degrees horizontally and 180 degrees vertically. This means that you have to capture every single spot in your surroundings with your camera. This also means that you can't avoid having the tripod show in your final panorama. Because this is obviously not the most beautiful thing to show, what you can do with 3D Vista Virtual Tool Suite is cover the tripod with what you call the tripod cap. The tripod cap not only allows you to hide the tripod, it also gives you the chance to place your logo or brand in the final picture. You can either choose this tripod cap, which comes with the program, or you can insert a tripod cap that you have previously designed according to your corporate identity and that carries your brand. Placing a tripod cap can be done with just one click. Here's how. This is the list of panoramas that I have added to my virtual tour. I'm going to select the one panorama that I want to place the tripod cap on. So I double click on that panorama. And as we look down to the lower part of the picture, you can clearly see the tripod that I was using when shooting this library. So what I do is I click on the tab tripod cap and with just one click I can add a tripod cap right here. Now you can either select the one tripod cap that already comes with the program, which is this one, or you can navigate to a folder where you store tripod caps that you might have pre-designed with your corporate brand or with your logo. I'm going to choose the one that comes with the software. Here it is. And depending on how much of the image the tripod actually covers, I can adjust the size of the tripod cap right here. This would be too little as you can still see the legs of the tripod. So I'm going to increase the size a little bit until it just covers my tripod. Like this. The remaining controls right here on the right hand side have to do with the kind or the behavior of the tripod cap. Generally you have two types of tripod caps. Fixed tripod caps, which remain still while I am spinning around. This type is especially useful if you choose a tripod cap such as this one that carries a compass. This kind of tripod cap is automatically selected whenever you see that this box right here is not ticked. Should you indeed use a tripod cap with a compass and realize that north is in fact not here in the middle, but rather, let's say, in the doorway, then you can change the position of the tripod cap using this position control. So I'm going to move the N for north over here to the doorway. The second type of tripod cap that you can choose is one that spins around with you. This is useful if you want your users to see your logo upright at all times. Choose this kind of tripod cap by ticking Rotate with Panorama. Now independently of whether your tripod cap is fixed or rotates, you can add inertia effect by ticking this final box here. Now the cap rotates with me, but also carries inertia effect. The alternative, a fixed cap with inertia effect, simulates a real compass perfectly, as you can see here. Thanks for watching.